Hi, this is Pat Love with Pat's Two Cents. I want to share something with you. Sometimes we think that whether it be family member, friend, church member, co-worker, best friend, ca uh, casual acquaintance, whatever, we think that many of these relationships are meant to stay for a lifetime. And we don't realize that there are reasons for each season. We say that about Christmas, but that goes for every season, whether it's a bright season or a dark season. There is a reason for every season in your life, nine times out of 10. It's for your growth, your development, your purification, your gaining knowledge, insight, understanding, maturing, being strengthened on the inner man. It, it, there are so many reasons for the seasons you have to go through. And there are designated seasons meant just for you. So listen, I want you to hear a little tidbit of what Tyler Perry says about people being placed in your life and being taken out of your life. This is a lesson we all need to learn. Listen to this. There are people who come in your life sometimes to be there for a season. They weren't meant to be there always. Sometimes we find ourselves hooked up with people that we think are there for a lifetime, but they were only supposed to be there for a season. There are people who come in your life like boosters for a rocket. If you ever watch a rocket go into space, the boosters fall off when it reaches a certain altitude. Some people are not equipped to handle the altitudes that you're going to. So don't be afraid when they fall off. They're not bad people. They just couldn't go where you're going. Some people really don't get you. They're not meant to. Just like the old expression when people complain about, oh, I never fit in. I never could seem to get my in crowd. Well, guess what? You were not created to fit in anywhere because God created you for a particular purpose and your purpose is not commonplace. You're not the norm. You weren't meant to be the norm. So stop trying to fit in and stop trying to hang on to friends that are trying to let go of you. If they're working their way out of, out of your life, let them go. Sometimes problems stir up in our lives, storms, all kinds of issues, because we're not willing to let go of friendships that were meant to be temporary. We want them to be a permanent fix. God says, curtain, curtains down, game over. This one is to move on. When you're not ready to let go, it causes a lot of issues, a lot of unrest, a lot of turmoil, relational problems, hurt feelings. You don't have to have your feelings hurt. Just yield to God's will and timing. Because when one leaves, another comes. And it's as God orchestrates. You stop trying to orchestrate who hangs and who leaves. You really have no idea. God is about purpose, not about your feelings. He will heal your feelings, but he's not about your feelings. He won't be controlled by them. So you stop trying to control your life and turn control over to your father, which are in heaven and you will gain the benefits big time once you let go and let God.